You may want to format the value for the timestamp in the cell within the worksheet. The raw value may not have as much meaning until the format is applied. The timestamp value also includes a millisecond value, so you can format this value to display the milliseconds along with the time. Next, we will demonstrate formatting the timestamp value. Of course, once you have the data in Excel, you have a multitude of tools available for formatting or viewing the data. Next, we will demonstrate a quick way of formatting the alarm messages in our worksheet. Up until this point, you have learned how to configure online tags, archive tags, as well as alarms for use in worksheets in Excel. You have learned a few formatting tips along the way, as well as how to update the data. However, to extend the use of your worksheets for use by data monitor clients over the web, you will need to publish the worksheet. Once the worksheet is published, the web server provides a link to the worksheet in the Reports Tool tab of the Reports section on the Data Monitor Client. Next, we will demonstrate how simple it is to publish workbooks for use over the Internet as well as the Internet.